a good morning. Today we're looking at the Koch roller chain breaker and supposedly this roller chain breaker will will uh, break really big chains to really small chains and then we've got some roller chain this is what they call number 41 which means it's a half inch uh, length and it ha takes a quarter inch inside diameter for the width of the sprocket they say it's for uh, industrial equipment and agricultural equipment uh, 10 feet long so if each one's a half an inch long that'd be uh, 240 lengths so the pitch is like they say a half an inch and here's uh, the various different uh, diameters so uh, the whole idea is is you buy a 10 foot length of this and it comes you can see there's a master link uh, pictured here it comes with a master link and you uh, break the chain at the right length and use a master link to connect it together and uh, and uh, you repair whatever the heck you have that's broken here I open the package and you can see it's one big round um, chain 10 feet diameter here you can see the master link and as you can see some of the the links have the number 41 stamped on them to let you know it's a number 41 you know ANSI number 41 chain so uh, so far so good well we start off you can see that we got the master link here and we uh, have to take the master link out well that was easy So here's here's the master link out and you can see it's uh, got a link assembly a, a top plate and then the the retainer I got my old chain and my new chain lined up and uh, pretty interesting uh, uh, the, the old chain was uh, slipping off every once in a while and I had to put it back on and finally the stupid thing broke on me but uh, the interesting thing is it over here so on the old chain I have 64 links and it's exactly 32 and 7 sixteenths inch length now let's take a look at and see what 64 lengths are in the new chain the new chain uh, 64 links is exactly 32 inches so I, I got that little stick at 32 inches there and you can see how much longer the new chain is it's almost stretched just about a half an inch so that explains a lot of the problems I was having and the reason you periodically need to buy new chains although I guess I probably could have just taken a link out of the old chain and put a master link in there but uh, boy I, I, you know you figure a length of chain we're talking like what maybe $14 uh, there's, there's no point in doing that okay I counted 64 you can see the, the 64th link and of course I'm gonna take that out and that'll make it 63 and then when you with the addition of the master link that'll be the 64th link so I uh, put a little mark around there just so they wouldn't forget which one it was the Koch chain breaker see it has an extra pin let's open the package and uh, take a better look okay here's uh, the chain breaker out of the package see it's kind of spring-loaded so you, you press and it can grip so I guess uh, it'll grip the, the chain and then in here we've got a, a pin kind of see the pin kind of goes in and out and that pushes the pin out of the chain so let's break some chain okay we open up the the vice grips it's on the roller chain and it's kind of got a notch in there so it's centered you can see that and now let's give it a try now we tighten it up tighten it up the pins on the pin oh I can see it pushing through oh not bad I made some progress I got now about an eighth of an inch. Let me just back it off a little bit. I'm going to try the other side. Don't want to go for too much too quickly. Got it crimped in there. I sure hope this is on camera. Okay. Oh, making contact. Oh, it's just it's going right through. It popped right out. 
take a look and see what we got. Okay, well we got the Well our chain is broken. Okay, I got my uh, chain. It's got 63 links in it, and then the 64th link will be the master link, and let's just go put it on. Okay, I got the chain in place, and as a convenient little place to hold, I actually got it in the sprocket. Okay, that goes on. Plate on. Got this thing. Oh. Ah, there it is. So now we just gotta tighten up the sprocket and we'll be all set.